that opposition is what we have been trying to provide. And in the last few months, we've been opposing the Tories, obviously very hard in Parliament. We forced them back on working tax credits, which they were trying to cut. And as a result, three million families have not had a thousand pounds taken out of their income this year because of your opposition, because of the Labour opposition, because of the votes we were able to muster in Parliament. Who said politics doesn't matter? the government in its budget tried to cut personal independence payments for people with disabilities. What a disgusting and disgraceful thing to do. To throw into the middle of the budget those cuts. And I met people in my own constituency office that evening and the following day who had uh, been threatened with loss of personal independence payments. A payment that was so crucial they built their lives around it and felt they at last were able to live in dignity because of all the campaigning all of us did over years. The government was shamed into retreat in three days on that one. See, they can be forced back if we take decisive, immediate action. And in that very same budget, George Osborne announced that every school would become an academy. That didn't happen, did it? we will back off on that pretty quickly when the teachers' unions and everybody else got together and set the academy. to bring in new Sunday trading laws that would have made life so much worse for so many shop workers. We defeated them on that and forced them back. And then there are other things that we've taken up, such as their disgraceful attempt for a British government-owned company to run the prison service in Saudi Arabia with its human rights record. We shamed them into withdrawing from that contract altogether and join in others in condemning the human rights record.